Yo, what is up guys? Shinobi EB here back again on another video for you guys and today we I and I can't I still can't talk right now. But today we are here with more Sword Online Last Recollection. Now I know it's probably taking me longer than I probably should to do the story. In fact, I should probably already have the story done by now. I'm gonna try and grind out some videos today for you guys. Um but we're we're gonna try. We're gonna try and get it all done. Or at least in this area. Like I don't know what we gotta do here, but for at least this area, we're gonna try and get it done. As for the team that we are running, I did more online play, obviously. I got like fifty hours into this game, which is crazy. Like this game has only been out for so long. I know I know there's probably people who got more hours than that, even because they've been streaming and whatnot. But for the team that we are using here, we're obviously using it myself, we're using Xenon. But using Silka, and then we also add in Yuki here. As for the gear that we are using, uh, obviously, I'm using the Heaven's Talent still. You know, I got the Dream Weaving Guard from the very beginning boss with the Spider with the cool passive that gives me a lot of HP and an emergency dodge skill speed plus 10%. You know, we got the Pure Heart, and of course, the Gall Talisman Stone that I got from doing a raid with somebody. So, we're, we're doing pretty good. Xenon's pretty much got her new armor and bow, which are actually stronger than the bow that I gave her in the very beginning of the game. Which is crazy to me, like, the bows that you farmed in the beginning of the game are weaker than the bow they just give you for free, and I bet there's even stronger ones later on when you do bosses and stuff like that, but that's actually nuts, and I kind of like this, because it makes the main weapons that the characters actually use reusable, though obviously with, you know, you got weapons like this, where you got like, you know, 5 star, 6 star rarity weapons, it's like, you know, it, it, it kind of gets power crap, but even still, it's still a pretty good weapon, at least for clearing the story, but... Um, other than that, moving on down to Silica here, obviously we gave her the Daybreak Dagger, which we got from, um, a raid quest that I was doing online. It wasn't, unfortunately, the max rarity, but it did come with a passive where, basically, a Skill Connect EX will be increased, and on Skill Connect EX, SP cost will be minus 10, which is not too bad. Uh, if we ever do have to use Silica for some reason, or if we want to add that combat skill on, that'd be pretty good. Especially since she is, of course, a alliance character. Everybody can get their hands on that. Uh, obviously, she has the Dream Moving Guard. I think I almost gave everybody the same armor. Except for the armor that's, like, better than that. That's just on them already. Uh, Ashman uh, Talisman Stone. You know, more skill connects. You know, obviously, because that's pretty pretty damn good. Uh, Moonlight Bug Ear Ring. And then Yuki here. I didn't have a sword that was stronger than the one she has, but actually her sword is stronger than the two that I was using on my dual wield in the beginning. So that, you know, that was interesting. And then her, even her armor is better than most of the armor, if not all the armor that I have. We also gave her a godlike talisman stone, which has the passive to give her sacred art power plus 50, which is nice because she's my second DPS. Whereas the other two are like sub DPS or support. And then the armor of Gladia even has some crazy passive on it where normal type power is plus 25 and skill power plus 5. And then Vivacity Ring, which, you know, mostly just a stat boost. But this is gonna be the turn. This is gonna be the team that we take Vector on with. So you now hopefully we can get some hands in here. And I always want to let you know that this this character, when it comes to like I forgot which move it is. We're probably gonna end up finding it out. There's one move that the fists have, or like the fist the rock lead build i'm gonna just call it has which is absolutely insane and when we fight back i'm just gonna show you to it i'm just gonna show you what it looks like because oh my lord oh lord man like it's it's busted but let's go ahead and get into this story which has actually been pretty good so far Something tells me that this story is not going to play out the same way that it did in the anime. Something, because there's no way, just based on what we've seen so far, I think everything from this point forward is going to be completely different. Because technically, at this point in time in the anime, Vector doesn't even get his hands on Alice. In fact, actually, he doesn't even get his hands on Alice at all in the anime. In fact, usually, wait, it was like Broccoli ends up going in, saving her. And then, spoiler alert, unfortunately, he ends up, you know, uh, sacrificing himself to take him out the first time. Then he comes back, fights Sinon for a little while, starts chasing Alice again. And then after that, Kirito shows up. And then they end up fighting. So I'm curious on how this is actually going to go. Uh, 
And I'll never get over the fact that we finally can see the weapons in this game. Like, holy crap, I'm so glad. Anyway, let's... You know what? I think it's probably... These guys want to fight us. This is like the perfect opportunity to show y'all this this crazy freaking machine gun. Like... Like, look at this. Oh, but this is the wrong move. I'm using the wrong move and I missed anyway. But this move, if I can get the damn thing to work. I think it's this. Oh yeah, look at this. Like, look, bro, right, as long as I have SP, I just spam that. I, I literally have a machine gun with fists, bro. That is ridiculous. Let's take this guy down. Boom. Into this. Hell, we want to go, we want to go even crazy. We got this. And then straight into this. Just look at this. Like, look at this. This is ridiculous. And because everybody's buffing me right now, I can just keep this going. Like, look at this. And then it finishes off with two punches. That is ridiculous. Like, what? I just become JoJo's up in here? Nah, I, I love the fisticuffs in this game, bro. I thought I was going to be going Duel World or Katana in this playthrough, but man... Why bother doing that? We well, can do this. Just go crazy on him. Go crazy on him. Anyway, let's get up here. Let's get past these guys because we really don't need to find them. And try and get the story. Oh, actually. Oh, do I go this way? Or? Oh, no. I go up here. Do I go up here? No. I, I probably have to go around. Yeah. But yeah, no. I was testing it online and it helps shred bosses. Now, obviously, these aren't the max gloves or whatnot that I could possibly use. But man, does it help shred bosses so much quicker than it would take normally to do. Oh, wait a minute. Let's take these guys out. We're not taking them out, but let's fall Victor down here. Oh, this is definitely the boss. We're fighting him already? Damn, all right. This is, hell, let's run the hands. Let's run the hands. Literally, in a literal sense, let's run the hands. Now, don't tell me he about to spawn another one of these. Man, did we not take out the first one? Did, like, are we really playing these games right now? Oh, uh, here's the flashbacks. Here's the flashbacks, boys. Oh boy, here, here's the flash. I'm, I'm about to turn my camera off for this one. Yujo got PST flashbacks for this, bro. He's like, yo, we are not doing this again. He said, I am not losing Alice again, bro. Sh tell him, Yujo, show us something real quick. Show us something real quick. Oh man, this is about to be good. Either way, uh, let's deal with this man because this is this is light work. This is light work, ladies and gentlemen. Hit him with the Rock Lee special, the dynamic entry, and then hit him with the machine gun. Like you guys seen how broken this shit is? I just gotta stand here. I haven't activated my own boss. I should probably do that too. Boom, into these, and then straight into this, into this, alright, let's get God War Warrior, oh no, it's even better, Sword of the Goddesses, into this, I think that's gonna stop us with that, we're about to break him already, which is nuts, boom, let him with this, alright, let's go boys, let's go, see you on, it's a Silica and Yuki. I'm so glad Yuki's in this fucking game, bro. I'm gonna try and make her like my main DPS at one point or another. Let's go crazy, boys. Now, how did he. I'm gonna say, now, how did you get up again after I just broke you? Get that out of here. Boom, boom. Like, look at that damage we're doing. This is just a normal skill, y'all. 
Hit him with the finish art. Give him the hands. Like Jesus Christ. <laughs> Let's go. Hit him with this. Into this. And with these. And with the lunar eclipse. And straight into this. Like we're cooking this boy. We are cooking this boy. Like I don't know what he doing. We dodge those. You thought you was catching us lacking out here? We dodge those, baby. Him with the uh huh into this. He's done. We might break him before we even have to use our ult again. We honestly might, because we're cooking him right now. Ooh, back up. Now we don't have goggle roll. There's God Now everybody got it. Alright, this should be pretty easy. Like, let them need to stop hiding, bro. And get this work. Because at this point, it's a wrap. At this point, it's a wrap. Hit him. Hit him with it. Boom. Boom. I love how, like, the movement. The movement is crazy. And yeah, that's, that's a wrap. Sit him down. All right, enough games, Vector. Come get these hands. Come get these hands, baby. Come get these hands. Now what are you gonna do? You gonna summon some more monsters up here? まあ、中だっただけだよ。それに俺の剣士としての強さも立ち向かう勇気も君がくれた。僕だけでは決して気づけなかった。I love to see you, Gio, in the, the game birth, bro, because, man, <laughs> as far as the anime goes, bro, I miss this dude. Like, God be one of the best friendships ever formed. Best, One of the best duos ever formed in Isekai, in general. ありがとう。なんだよ。きっとこんな時に言うセリフじゃないけど。ありがとう。僕はきっと今あの頃なりたかった僕に慣れてるんだ。勇士よ。違うよ。お前が俺に付き合ってくれ。Man, the PTSD that Kirito went through after Yujiro died in the anime was freaking wow. It was it was rough. It was rough for that man, bro. Yeah, nah, we... He better not summon no nonsense either, bro. Like, he better be ready to fight. He better be ready to run these pockets, bro, because the time for running is over, brother. The time for you to be running around doing all this extra shit is over, ladies and gentlemen. I forgot, I didn't even activate any of the buffs that I have on Ceno. I keep forgetting, I have Ceno as a cut and a buffer slash DPS. So, let's let's get this done. I don't need to make preparations, bro. I am the prep time. Let's do this. Alright, Vector, prepare to get smacked up. そんな体でどこに行こうというのだ。立っているのすらやっとだ。君にふさわしい場所へ連れて行きたいだけだ。ふざけるな。何がふさわしいか。どこにいるべきか。それは私が決めることです。私はもう二度と誰かに自分を分
I'm gonna say, we are not about to leave Fo out there with a W, bro. He's getting the work. Man, the only thing that he's about to be regretting is these hands that you're about to get faded by, bro. Uh, most deaf. Talk your shit for real. All right. Well, uh, time to run the fade. I've seen on what's what's perform the duties of running that fade. All, right. All buffs up. All right, and let's pack them up. <laughs> Formula HP light work. Light work, baby. Light work. Get these hands. Boom. Hit him with this. Hit him with the flashbang. And then him with the rapid fire. Hit him with the rapid fire. Yeah, buddy. Come get this. And we're about to break him. Now, where are you running? Why are you running, buddy? You can't run from this fade. You think you can run from the fade? You think you can run from the fade we're handing out? You thought you can run from this fade that we're handing out here to me, sir? Yeah, no, buddy. Launch this man and give him the hints. There's no way I missed. Either that or it's just going just almost. I'm sitting right there. There's no way I missed that shit. He's sitting right there, floating in the air. Brothers floating in the air. Ooh, right over the head. Styling on him. Styling on him. This man is la this man is stuck. He's not yeah, no. He's getting rotated out here, brother. He getting rotated out here. And we ain't even done with his ass yet. We ain't even done with him. We still got more. We still got more. Running this man's fade. Look at that damage, baby. Look at that damage. He can't handle this. Boom. Boom. Hit him with this. Go straight into this. Yep. Yup. Get this hands. Get these hands. Cause you ain't running from him. Alright, you wanna sit back there? I got something for you. Hold this. Now, what are you running for? This man's scared, bro. He don't want it. He don't want the fade. Hit him with the rapid fire. Boom. Yeah, you're done. You're done. Alright, second phase, because you already know this man is going to come back. There's no way he's not coming back. Where's the second phase at? Nobody <laughs> Man, we ain't laughing about nothing. Just take the L and leave, brother. Take that L and leave. Get out of here. Wait, that's it? No, no round two? Nah, there's gotta be a round two. Especially from the trailer. We saw him in that other form that he had in the anime. There's no way there's no round two. Yeah, I'm about to say, I know this dang war ain't over yet. I know for a fact this shit ain't over, bro. What's, what are we talking about? Chapter 7 is done, though, so we got that. Well, at least the actual war is over, though. 
Well, yeah, because everybody figured out they were getting manipulated in the first place, especially in the dark territory. They were all getting manipulated. I'm so glad that we got everybody up in this game right now, bro. Yeah, now Dorothy sacrificed everything for that. You know what's crazy, too? It's technically wasn't even Vector who caused them to start the war in the anime. Well, I know he was. But it was mostly Fo who was doing all the patrolling shit. Which I find is interesting how they changed it this time. And also Shasta and Lipia, they ended up trying to stop Vector the first time. Or Gabriel, technically. And they ended up dying before the war even began. Damn, she's still asleep. And considering that she used so much power, I'm not surprised. But damn. Dorothy True. Though I think she'd be glad to see that the war is over. Oh yeah, where the hell is Di's ass? Cause you already know she's gonna try and betray us for some shit now that she's asleep. Damn, that's crazy. That, yeah, I want to say, where's the faith at, bro? <laughs> no, technically, I am su not surprised. Because technically, the Alice that we know right now isn't the actual one. It's somebody else in a different body. お待たせ Alright, we got more help, boys. We probably got to go on a bunch of quests to help out. This reminds me of the Arphasis quest in Fatal Bullet. Man, Fatal Bullet was such a good ass game, bro. We need a Fatal Bullet too. But, um, this reminds me of one of the DLC quests where you had to go and get a bunch of materials to help out one of the Arphasis that you had to fight. I think it was in the second. Um, it was the second. It was the first and second DLC. So, all right, but we still got foe down here, so we know this war ain't over by a long shot. We still got foe running around. He's probably gonna cause problems. You already know that you know Gabriel's gonna come back with a second account. <laughs> but at least all the underworld understands that yo, uh, this man come back. It's time to run the fade. All right. 
chapter 8. And I think that's where we're going to stop. I'm just going to do it chapter by chapter. Because sometimes some of these quests be taking a while. Oh, here we go, baby. Additional characters have been selected as party members that can be switched in via party setup screen. Shasta, Lipia, Ashken, D.I. Eel, Silica, she's going to use combat skills the Secret Arts. Makes sense. She was like that in the other game as well. But we got our boy Ashken, bro. We about to have... I thought I was going to make a... Con Ooh, and we got way put Oh, we got Wayfarers now, too. Nice, nice. Nice. Okay, so we got Wayfarers as well. All right, not bad. But once again, this is where we're going to end today's episode. I know probably one of the shorter ones. Well, actually, not even short. That was like 25 minutes. But, um... Don't want to, you know, to make it too long because, you know, the last couple ones have been like 45 or so. So, we'll start the next one probably right after this, after I get done doing some editing and whatnot, and then we'll get it all started. But without further ado, if you guys do enjoy the video, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more Sword Online and anime content. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.